So one of the, the challenges of building the ship is you have frames that curve up on the sides, but then the, sh the boat also shapes towards the bow, it gets narrower, to the, to the transom it gets uh, narrower, and so you've got these complex curves. And of course, down at the keel, you have no bevel on the frame, but then as you go up, it, the bevel changes. So you need this very unique piece of equipment, this ship saw. The patent on this equipment is from 1889. The saw itself was made in 1920s. Uh, it's, a, it's just a beautiful piece of equipment. And the way it works is, is that it has a, a table that's very flat and can hold a heavy weight because our futtocks that we use to make up our frames are very heavy. But then the whole saw, it's a band saw, the whole mechanism will rotate right around the top of the table. And that's what allows us to cut it a bevel. It's typically a three-person operation where you have two people pushing the wood through the saw and making sure you stay right on the line and another person operating the equipment that actually gets the bevel right. And you can take a look at the piece of wood before they put it through there and you'll see all the lines and you'll see all sorts of markings all over it. All those markings are the registrations for where that piece of wood's going to go very precisely. We're trying to stay within a sixteenth of an inch on the ship and you'll see things that look like little carrots or greater than or less than signs and those tell you whether it's a standing bevel or an under bevel. Whoever's driving the equipment knows how to adjust the machine so that it has the right angle of bevel and they have to adjust it while the wood's going through there so that by the time they get to that next mark they're at that correct bevel. Now by doing that when we put the frames up we'll be able to take these large planks for the ship, which are going to be two and a quarter inches thick and then eight inches high and up to 38 feet long, and we'll be able to lay them against the frames and they're going to lay nice and tight and the, and the wood will touch the entire nine and a half inches along the frame. So we'll have a really solid ship.